Welcome back to the channel, guys. I'm John. What's going on, everybody? I'm Steve. This one's called The Collectors. I know. <sighs> Serial killers, you know? Yeah. Yeah, we have what? Well, technically, this is the second to last. The ultimate. Because 11 was, it was like a, bon a bonus. I think it's like a bonus episode or something like that, someone said. When did this come out? Earlier this year? With, or within last the, year? Within the, no, within like the past like six months, I think. At some point. It was definitely this year, and yes. it came out at like with the eleventh as a bonus, or like later on. I, that I don't know. Like one, they just popped one out. That's that's what I'm assuming, but that's I don't know I for think, sure. But yeah, somebody will definitely let us know. Yeah, that's for sure. I don't know, man. I love it. Yeah, I think it's cool as hell. It is. Like obviously, those it's going to be tough to beat five and six, especially six. For I think six was the one I liked the best. That was the one because it was like such a. Star contrast two between the two Two different stories. episodes in one. Oh, no. Now, I love them both equally. So For much. different reasons, though. Yeah. It's going to be tough to beat it. Well, I'm, I think they're going to do it. But, yeah, I'm not too fond of his attitude in the last No, you one. know he'll change, though. He'll figure it all Rose, out. Rose and Lucian will fix him up. And Matthew. Matthew, of course. Yeah, Matthew's always the voice of reason. <laughs> He's like, no, that's a crow. That's a crow. I'm a raven. <laughs> he's like, get it right. right? <laughs> All of a sudden, he's like, now that's a good question, though. Like, so he said he died, and the next thing he knew, he was a raven. That's, but why, though? Because whatever happens after they die. But that would put a hole in our theory of when you die, you go into like your own dream. Because you know what I mean. I don't think you're really in like your own dream per se. I think you can choose to live in the dream realm once you die. Mm. Um, and be like, well, a I took it as Morpheus's like crew. you go in and into the dream world, you create your own dreams. But if you have bad thoughts too, like nightmares can come alive too, you know? Well, I just thought that because you are but then living you can go in the dream and stuff, you know? So, but I guess that's like, all right, no, you're going to hell. Come on. Well, hell is a diff just a, its own realm. No, I know that, but I'm saying, like, for people that die. Yeah. Well, I'm assuming you die. You go to your judgment, and it's decided where you go there. You're either going to hell, you get to go to the dreaming, maybe you get to decide. Well, I wonder, yeah. I wonder and, um, yeah, maybe, uh, who knows why Matt, why he was chosen to be a raven, but yeah, cause he maybe because they needed, it was probably because they needed... Another one? Uh, he, like uh, somebody that was a human, and who knows if that's what they usually do. Because he, he needed to go find... It, he was to help him out in the Yeah, in I the know that. World. But so. it's just like, why him, though, you know? Maybe we'll find out. I hope. That'd be awesome. That'd be really cool. <laughs> I don't think so. Back, watch better. him be created. <laughs> I, would, yeah, I do really <laughs> want to see that. Like, I want to see Pat really Oswald, Oswald, Oswald. Yeah. And then want to see him all of a sudden like wake up and then realize he's a bird. Yeah, he said that, right? He said he just died what like yesterday. What the hell? Yeah. <laughs> I think he said like 15 hours or something like Ooh, that. Yeah, right? it was like crazy. For whatever, I had fingers and no, now I have, have these. These, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's watch it. That's it. Jed was gone. And they were dead. I know, it's hard to believe, but... I believe you. Because last night, I had a dream that I spent the night with Hector. And... When I woke up this morning. <laughs> oh my God. I know. Is it real? Feel it. Yeah, because it's all her dreams that are coming true that she wanted to have, you know? So it's like, because dreams aren't necessarily just dreams, oh you know? Like, it's your dreams for the future and stuff, too. That's true. What is so, like, so it's not ghost sperms. It's just it's, it's her a, dreaming. I think I know the answer to that. Kind, yes. But it's the vortex that's I making think it. It's me. Yeah. Matthew's like, shut up. God, that place is so cool. so cool. I don't know how she did it, but Rose just got Lyda pregnant. It's none of my business. Uh, since when? Since Lord Morpheus reminded me that I'm merely a librarian and should concern myself with my Can't books. Can't be petty now. now. He said that? He's gonna go straight. What's wrong with him? <laughs> Nothing is wrong with him. Now's not the time to be fighting. Not when there's a vortex getting people pregnant and runaway nightmares doing God knows what. <laughs> Always the voice of reason, Matthew. Yeah. 
What's your name? Have you ever noticed how people only ever use your name when you're in trouble, Jed? We need to talk, Jed. <laughs> it's true. Get in here, Jed. You sound like my Uncle Barnaby. Exactly. He's gonna come looking for me. No. <laughs> no, he's not. He always comes looking for me. I will fix this. I will she make it baby. go away. No, you won't. Look, whatever's happening, however it's happening, our dreams are coming true. You found Jed in your That's dreams. the allure of it, I guess, right? And I found Hector. Hello? Hi. I'm calling because I found one of your flyers about a missing boy. Yes. I think I found him. Rose? Jed? Hi. Hi. I, I can't believe it. Are you okay? Where are you? We're at a hotel in Georgia. Corinthians doing a good job Can of just lowering your man, yes, yeah. I'm leaving right now, Jetty. Tell me the name of the hotel. Oh my god, serial convention. The Royal Empire Hotel. Royal Empire Hotel. <laughs> Look how many serial killers these people are. Oh, that's crazy. You're about three hours from here. Thank you. Oh, I almost forgot. What's your name? We'll see you soon. <laughs> how does that not throw up any red flags for you? Especially after those two are just dead. And now he's with him. Yeah. This is ridiculous. I mean, in Corinthians' defense, he's the guest of honor. Nobody's touching him. Well, yeah. So, this is probably the safest place the on earth. <laughs> I know, it's still, I'm just talking in general. <laughs> it is like a comic book convention. That's how they're flying it up, though. What you looking for? Nemesis of neglect. There you go. Nemesis of neglect. Oh no, there he is. Oh no! You may want to advise him to steer clear of the convention areas. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny, the way he said it. Okay, it's Gilbert. You're not going alone, I hope. Uh, Lyda's not feeling well, so. You must allow me to accompany you. Uh, I believe America is a very Imagine if he's a total badass. Place. Imagine if he should have been the guest of honor at that convention. As the other <laughs> oh, yeah. And they're like, Gilbert? Oh my god. I see you met my young friend. Oh, is he with you? He is. He and his sister are my guests and under my protection. Are we good? We are, yeah. We're good. I'm glad to hear it. Content. Nice to meet you. I love this subtle cockiness threat to it. Who could stop him? Nobody right. in that room. He could no. slaughter everybody. You're right. Oh, not at all. And, and you and Miss Hall will be going home, I assume, uh, with Jen? Uh, Lyda has other plans, actually. Oh, yes, you said that um, she wasn't feeling very well. Is everything all right? I hope so. I can't get a read on Gilbert at all. I want to like him so bad. I'm like, I think it's like sometimes like we're just assholes. So like, like maybe they are just sweet, little bit odd people. <laughs> I know. And like we're just the dickheads. I'm like waiting. Like, I'm wait fucked up. I'm waiting for that moment. I'm waiting for that moment to just be like, oh, thank God, we're we're okay. Yeah, you're gonna really giving it to her, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Damn. <laughs> Screw shaking the headboard. Shaking the whole room. What was that? Does this look like a nightmare to you? Not at all. Where do you get your groceries from? I can change from? in a second. Where do you get your groceries from? Are you crazy, dude? They can make babies out of thin air. You think they need to eat? Use your head. Well, that sucks. I want to eat. I enjoy eating. You just think about Oh, it. shit. Just think about what you want, Dan. It'll just appear. Do you even know how dreams work? It's like a huge-ass crack. 
Well, because they said the walls would crack, right? Yeah, she's like probably. That's probably the. Dude. Whoops. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Not boss. him again. I, I was looking for Lucy. I like him. Oh, yeah, so do I. Wait. Shit. My lord. I have come to return these and to assess the extent of the damage from the recent disturbances. Have you any idea as to what <laughs> yeah, he, he doesn't know what to do. Rose Walker has visited this realm before and done no damage. This is something else, something new. Perhaps. But if there is something new in She's this definitely realm, right. and you did not create it, how did it get here? Correct. This is the vortex, I assure you. Good. Thank you. Thank you. They all need to merge this convention. Let's, ra let's ra get rid of these cereals. <laughs> cereals. The only thing I remember about him is he used to love chicken fingers. That's all he'd eat for a meal. He'll eat anything now. Probably completely mm, different now. I want chicken now. fingers. Yeah, me too. And he's got him. <laughs> yeah, of course. We'll be here in a few hours, and then I told him we do whatever you want. And just stay in the room until she gets here. Okay. I can't go with you. Oh, no, no, trust me, you don't want to. <laughs> no, Unless don't. Boring grown-ups down there. You know he's sneaking out. He's a run he runs away, man. <laughs> thank, thank you all for being here. Uh, yeah, uh, <clears throat> I heard a story recently. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Uh, crazy. Excuse you. We don't shit where we eat. So, nobody does any collecting until the convention's <laughs> over and you're at least 200 miles away. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> it's so fucked up. I'm boring you. Not at all. Oh, good, because I do love a paradox. Just so did, too. Take charity, for example. Charity usually means one of two things. Honestly. Pardoning an unpardonable act or loving an unloving... It's a great act and a false sleep yeah. love. Love's an even better one. To love means loving the unlovable. Oh, great. Now she can tell him where she's gone. To forgive me. He, he's already the gone there. That's true. Faith means believing the unbelievable. She seems like she's where her friend's house is, though. And hope means... Tell Lucien she was right about the source of the traumas. And that I'm taking care of it. Oh boy. Hector, look who's here. <laughs> what do you want? He wants us to leave. Why? Because Is it them a ghost doing can't it? escape his fate by hiding in the dreaming. Mm, so yeah. Wrong. What kind of living human being escape her grief here? Is there anything we can do? You belong with the dead. You must go to the place appointed for you. Appointed for you. Okay. We were right about that. Yeah, yep. I'm sorry. But they can't but let you must say goodbyes now. That's the whole point. You can't have anything slip through the cracks. I'm not losing you again. Enough. Oh, that's so weird. Please stop, Hector. Please, please stop. No! Hector! <laughs> Your husband died a long time ago. He was a ghost. I'm gonna say he is right, though. Yeah. Sometimes the harsh truth is the so harsh, you know. From now. Oh, he's giving her the baby. The child was conceived in the dreaming. It is mine. What? And one day, I will come for it. No, you won't. You won't do nothing. This dream is over. <laughs> He's ridiculous. You killed my friend. Oh shit. How did you get here? In front of his wife, and then you threatened to take her baby? Do you know why this happened? Listen to me. I do listen to you. You said that a vortex can create universes or destroy them. So I suggest you leave my universe the fuck alone. Bros. This dream is over. Damn. I'm the boogeyman, by the way. <laughs> so is he? Oh. <laughs> yeah. See, can I 
I would drink if I promise not to ask too many annoying questions. I don't want to monopolize you. Yeah, let's get that drink later. Well, I see you met the boogeyman. <laughs> this is so crazy. And that's not the boogeyman. Are you sure? The boogeyman's dead. He drowned in Louisiana three years ago. How do you know? I know. <laughs> we will deal with this. Shit. Oh, really? At least he saw him, huh? Yeah. Oh, it wasn't him. That's great. Now we left him in there alone. Get back there, man. There are no kids in the convention area. I would know. <laughs> no children at a serial convention. That seems a bit of a missed opportunity, or, or, or is it maybe sort of more of a porridge and muesli do, thing? Do, do you mind? I have to check these people in. Imagine how annoyed he'd be if he found out we have these. What? Oh, oh she... I take it we're attending the convention then. I'll check the pool, you check the convention hall, and we'll meet back here in 15. How exciting! I've never been an uncle before. <laughs> I can't tell if what, this, what Gilbert's deal is. I think he's just a nice guy. I hope so. I really want him to be good. I don't want to see him whip some ass. Yeah, he's definitely going to whip some ass. <laughs> he said he's got a sword and a pistol. The goal is to drag out hope, because they will pay you for proof that the trophy is alive. It's not a ton, but it's usually good for a few grand at least. Any extra cash is nice, but we don't do it for the money. We do it because <laughs> we're called to do it because we love doing it. Man, a torso, and a torso, even more so. Lydia, oh, Lydia, that ain't <laughs> He's like, what the? Intelligence, preparedness, and brute force, if necessary. <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny him figuring it out. Won't take just anybody. Specialize in connoisseur. It would be this confusing. Yes. Be like, Wait a I can't be right. Are they killers? It's not up to me to decide who lives and who dies. It's up to God. God tells me to do it. Tells me that yeah, that's a confirmation right there. The Chase blog is written by an apparent fanboy. As fans of yours, we have to ask, could we watch you work? Oh, oh my god. Or we could work together and share the experience. <laughs> <laughs> work together. <laughs> Does he know him? Yep. Hi, this is Walker calling again. I'm at the pool now, but I Do you think Corinthian was... Oh, was it one of his nightmares? Anyway, call me when you get this. Can you leave a message for her, please? From Gilbert. Hey, I was just looking for you. Do you, um... Do you have time for... Just bounce on her, huh? the bar now? Oh, you're Rose Walker. I am. Why? I have your room key right here. My room key? Oh, the kid and a did it. From Gilbert. I see. He says he's very sorry, but he had to go home. She's found them both. What? The Corinthian and Fiddler's Green? Where? How do you know? Fiddler's Green told me. Duh. You know, I had that thought during the last episode, and it, I totally forgot about it. Apologies, Lord, for having left. The Corinthian has found Rose Walker. Yes. Can you imagine the damage he could do with someone like Rose? You must tell me where they are. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. <laughs> Very interesting, because Rose hates him. Well, that too, yeah. Uh, who knows what kind of power she has in the waking world, but I'm assuming so, uh, like she has some. What's going on? We know. Who you are, Philip. <laughs> <laughs> what are you? A good doctor. She likes to kill her victims by removing their organs, one 
by one. Nimrod's a hunter. He can skin, bone, joint, gut just about any animal in minutes. And as for me, well, I like the eyes. Oh, shit. This one's mine. <sighs> oh, buddy. Oh. Sorry. Are you okay? What's wrong? Just when I thought this couldn't get any worse. You'll be safe in my room. Yeah? <laughs> this is going off. Show's crazy. Then perhaps he will be merciful to you since you came back on your own. Oh, it, it, it doesn't matter what happens to me. What matters is that Dream stops the Corinthian and saves Rose Walker. <laughs> no, he's great. There is no saving Rose Walker. He's, he's going to have to kill her. Oh. You know they're gonna end it on us like jerk yeah, offs. For sure. Jed? Rose. You can't have him! Ah! He's mine! Ah! We will play it! Let him go! He's my brother! He's mine! Let me go! Oh! Yes. Oh my god. Well, Morpheus and Corinthian should both be showing up. <laughs> They're making us want this guy to get killed. That's what it's great. I wanted everybody in this episode to get killed. Yeah, right? Except these two. Now I'm going to have to hurt you. Hello, Ruth. You're safe with me. <laughs> God That's damn it. it. Another hell of an well, episode. Well, well, well. Here we are saying the same this damn thing again. This show doesn't give a fuck. No. It's clear as day. It's crazy. That's why they brushed over poor Unity being raped while she was sleeping. Mm -hmm. They knew how fucking insane this show was. Then nobody would even think about you that. You think that was bad? Oh, that's bad? Yeah. Watch this serial convention that we <laughs> put together. Watch how disgusting this fat piece of shit is while he's chasing this kid. Yeah. He's like, uh... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> disgusting. They did that a couple times in this one. They did it with the... Um, or was that the last episode? I guess it was. When um, they were just making the Barnaby, like, over-the-top piece of shit. Like, yeah. Like, we're Such like, as fuck. Yeah, like, yeah, this is like a great show for just like getting your anger out and like wanting people to be killed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but then also learning a lesson on the other side of yeah. it. Yeah. You know? And then also really, really liking people. It's a no, great show. No one you can Sends change. You, sends your emotions all over the goddamn place. So how do you think he's going to get out of it like, without killing her? Like, like, one would assume that he's not actually going to kill her, you know? I think it's going to be she's she's uh, a like a good person, so she good can, hearted person she anyway. And it. he said, like, you have the ability to travel through any whatever dream, I guess. Yeah. But also the power. Cause why, he kept saying destroy universes. So. Well, that's one of the it other. might be more powerful than like even just like the dream realm, like maybe able to destroy multiple realms. Well, yeah, that's because they even said that they're she's so, cracking all the walls between they're all the realms. So it's definitely not. Well, just the no, dream. she's cracking the wall between the dream realm and, and the everything. waking realm. Is that what it is? I believe so. Oh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Um, but uh, who's to say if she can go to multiple realms or not? And if that were to be the case, then I guess if she were good, she could just travel to him. But if she were bad, she could destroy him. That's the question. Him. So is there a way? If if she, she can, can she just control it? And then once she dies, it goes away, you know, like. I don't think she has to control it. I don't think she really has it in her to do it. I think she was just 
Well, then she, she to- wants to get her brother back. So she is like a tough girl. So she was like using that as a threat. But I don't know that she would like if no, you destroy the dream world. That's not what it. I'm saying. I'm saying she can just live with it like where it doesn't destroy her or doesn't do anything. Oh, that's what I'm saying. She's going yeah. to. Yeah. Like, that's that's why I'm saying. I don't even think it. she has it in her to do that. That's what I was saying. We were agreeing. I was just elaborating on it. I don't even think she has it in her to destroy. Like, you know, she used it as a threat to Morpheus. Like, I don't, that was just no, a threat. Yeah, like, I don't not. think she would even do it. No, definitely not. Like, the only way I could see it happening is if, like, it somehow was able to, can like, consume her. Well, that's kind of what it is, it seems like. like. <sighs> well, now I'm not too sure if those cracks... No, were the, cr- the cracks were because of the... It was the a mix ghost, of, right? I think it was a mix of both. And then, like, she, but like, she was co- the causing that to be able to happen. Correct. And then they were causing it by they were causing the cracks. Thing. Yeah, I think. I think so too. Well, I, like I said, Maybe. I think it's both of them doing it. Like you just, he's counting it yeah. as one. Yeah, I don't think what he did with with that guy was wrong. You know, he could have been a little nicer about it, but to who? What's her name? Lida. Lida? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What's yeah. It, what is her name? Yeah. Lida? Lida, yeah. I, I don't know. Yeah. But he was dead right with, with what he was saying. Dead right. Yeah, man. You can't be selfish in Pun intended. Yeah. That's not it's not meant for that. No, yeah. he obviously didn't follow where he was told to go. Which was caused by that's the way I was taking it. Which was caused by her uh Rose. Oh, you think so? That's what I was. I've been. Guessing. I'm thinking that they were able to come in contact with each other was because of Rose, but he didn't go to where he was assigned. He didn't even belong in the dreaming. Well, that's what I'm saying. So what oh caused that? yeah, Rose caused. He even said it. He had a dream. That was his dream. Yeah, he got while he was there. there, and then he was able to stay there. Because Lucian even said something about the dream past merging or something like that. Yeah, I think that's what it is. They're converging from the living. It could be from anywhere, I guess. Anywhere someone's dreaming, you know? doesn't matter. Yeah. As long as you have dreams. Like, so can... Well, maybe not. Well, can... Let's put it this way. Can um, Morpheus see if somebody in hell is dreaming? That's can why he I see may, it? That's why I don't think they can, because... No, right? Because don't... They only exist because the humans exist? Yes. So, like, if there's it's no only living more be- living beings, they wouldn't exist. That's true. So, they can't be. But I guess it is. <laughs> yeah, because he said pick your destination or something like that, right? Well, he said where you, you go where you're assigned. Right. But it made it seem like there was just, like... Yeah. That's like we were saying in the last episode. Right. Like, they go somewhere and they're just- like, hell, heaven, you're going to stay here and, f- and file my paperwork. Yes. You know what like, I mean? that's Raven. Yeah, Raven. Yeah. But it's like, but I feel like if you're going to hell, it's like obvious. It's like, well, yeah, hell. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, obviously, Get the that, fuck out of like, here. Like, where was he going, you know? Yeah, that's, uh, we don't know. So is there, like, an actual thing where there's, like, this is kind of where I'm still confused about. It's like, all right, so say you have the living realm, the dream realm, uh, hell, then you have, well, we don't know what else. All of his siblings. Do they all have, like? Maybe. Is there a realm of death of despair? And I'm assuming that's where, sh- at least the desires but, realm but is not, where you're still awake going when you go through despair now. Yeah. So how you don't go to a? I don't know. Realm. But, um, you know what I'm saying? But desire was in was somewhere. I know that, but uh, they were in like that red like cave like place. Well, it was that huge human? It was the human giant human version yeah. of themselves going like this yeah, in the right. middle of the sky. But well, that's my point, though. Like in the dream realm, like oh. people from that are living can go there just by dreaming. If you're going through despair, you're awake, so it's like you can't go any. You don't go anywhere. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, they must only operate in the waking world. Right. Exactly. Well, I think that's why they don't like, or why they're plotting against Dream, and why they think he's like. Yeah, we keep, stealing what they do. We haven't seen Desire in a couple episodes now, so no. they're going to pop up very soon. Obviously, in the next one, I'm sure, because it's the finale, you know? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, yeah. So that's good, at least. So he got everybody back. He's got to go finish up 
some loose ends here with the Corinths. Yeah, I swear last episode I had it in my head, but I, I, I was trying to remember what the other was Corinthian, the one that he got already, and then... Gold, I guess. Yeah, I couldn't remember Gold. what the third one's name was, and I'm, I was trying to say, like, do you think that could be... That uh, Gilbert. Gilbert could be... But I couldn't remember the name, so I didn't say it. What was the name? Still forgot, right? Yep. Mm-hmm. Oh, it was he, uh, the fit. It was the the fiddler, fiddler, the fiddler something. Right? Yeah, because yeah. he looks like a fiddler. <laughs> yeah. So that's cool, man. I liked him a lot. Yeah, I think. He's and then a- I think once, once Morpheus settles Corinthians and like f- deals with the vortex, Gilbert's good to go. I don't think he's gonna get punished, and he should bring back the other gold one. too. Yeah. Only it's only Corinthians that's really the problem. Yeah. He's the only bad one. Yep. You think he kills all those serial killers too? That'd be cool. He might. <laughs> because like they don't oh, like Oh, you mean Dream? Yeah. Yeah. They don't like when they when they fuck with well, he, like the, the if you're causing harm or something well, yeah, like that. Oh yeah, cuz he even said to him like whatever, he has a whatever Gilbert cult said to him. of people that are yeah. That are trying to inflict harm on like the waking world. Like he's like boosting their, their problems. Yeah. Which is kind of like, um, like I'm happy that he's going there, but that's a lie. <laughs> they yeah. hunted him down. Right. <laughs> but, so like, if this yeah. obviously makes it mu- look much, much worse than it, then not saying that Corinthians is good in any way, but like, he just wants to not, not exist. Right. That's his only goal. And like, he is like, not really... I really like him as a bad guy. Like, everybody that we've seen him kill has been deserving, Uh, right? Except a couple people that we don't know. That first guy we saw. We don't don't know what what had happened. But he's a nightmare. So he's kind of living on the same path that um, Lucian was saying Morpheus is on, where, like, he only sees, like, the negative in the people, and that's... Which, is like, I feel like that this whole season almost has been about him learning to, like, like, what... Death was saying to him about like, like they we need chance, them as like, just as much as they need us, yeah. you know, and all that. Right. Just to that's I'm telling you, and the whole theme is going to be like because Gilbert even said like he changed, he's changed, he apologized pretty much. Almost. Yeah. I was waiting for it too. <laughs> you know, it's some bullshit. Like when you did something yeah, fucked but, up, and you're just like, well, you were right about that. Sometimes you could just tell I it's, was wrong. Yeah, I know. It's like, all right, I'll, say I'll take that as an apology. Uh, you take it. But just know you're also an asshole for not saying it. Yeah, but it's like after a while, you'd be like, that's ah, just the way he is. Yeah, obviously, you could tell. He know that's the way he is. I have sympathy for those people. <laughs> We've had this exact conversation off camera. <laughs> yeah, every time I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> no, this is great. It kind of sucks when I two really, left. I know. One, I love it. One man. and two, you know. I really, really, really love it. I know. We should actually check this comic out. I might. But now, like, do we? Then we're going to know too much. Hmm. <laughs> maybe we got to wait to see what happens with the show, watch the show, and then... Comic readers then can let us know in the comments, like, is it safe to read Will or Bear. is it like... Or Will Bear will tell us. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hope we're hope of watching this, too. <laughs> I'm not even going to mention it to him prehand until he watches this because I want to see if he like, picks up on it. Yeah. yeah. Then we'll know if he watches the whole video or not, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. This is great. Love it. Anyway, guys, make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel. See you next time. See you later.